1966, Bob Dylan released his magnum opus. His album Blonde on Blonde is considered by many to be his greatest work ever committed to record and is Dylan in the most creative and prolific stage of his career. Cut to 50 years later in 2015 and Kendrick Lamar releases his third studio album To Pimp a Butterfly. With its sonic experimentation, utilizing jazz, funk, soul and hip-hop, and its ability to capture the social consciousness at the time, while still speaking into the future, it changed music forever. These of course are two very different albums, from two very different eras, but they share a common ground in that they are both breathtaking displays of artists at their absolute peak. I'm sure there are people who would say that Dylan and Lamar both had other peaks in their careers, and while that may be true, I believe that these albums came at a time when both these artists were in a stage in their careers that we'll call the golden window. The golden window is a period of time when an artist's ability and talent is at its peak, but the creativity and passion for the art is also at its peak. Actor Edward Norton said while speaking about Dylan that an artist's talent, skill, creativity and instinct all have different journeys to reaching their peak, but that the artist's peak come when all these things intersect. There's no such thing as overnight success. Success, especially the heights of success that artists like Bob Dylan and Kendrick Lamar have reached, comes when years of hard work are rewarded with an opportunity to showcase the results of that hard work. When we see people we admire who have reached levels of success that we aspire to reach, we usually just see the finished product. But we need to realize that 99% of what helped them succeed is the years of hard work they put into their craft. Once we create this inseparable relationship between success and hard work, the two will soon start to become synonymous, and that will in turn allow our attitude to move from a fantasy of success to a lifestyle of preparation and hard work. Kendrick Lamar says that it took hours, days and years of making music in his mother's kitchen to reach the heights he has. Dylan says that his album Blonde on Blonde is the closest he ever got to the sound he heard in his head, and he was finally able to bring it to reality with this album. This shows us that it's not just success in terms of recognition that hard work produces, but also the satisfaction of being able to articulate the ideas we have in our heads through our art without any compromises or limitations that our skill or ability places on us. Kendrick Lamar was able to do the same by articulating the ideas he had in his head, but he was also able to articulate the voice of an entire generation and culture, and this was only made possible because of his hard work and dedication to being the best at his craft. Luck is when preparation meets opportunity. So if we want to achieve the levels of success of the people that we admire, preparation, practice and hard work should be our priority so that when the opportunity does present itself, we're more than ready to make the most of it.